Okay, we left off on Tzadi Beis and Aleph. Well, the Vomer Blazer, wide lines, that six lines. Kol Odom Shem Bildeo, person who has no deo, he has no discretion. The Sov Gola Otom Bleke Be Exiled, Shinemar, Lechain, Gola Ami Mimble Das. Why was my nation, why were they exiled? Because they behaved like as if they didn't have any understanding. Vomer Blazer, Kol Bay Shem Divrei Torah Nishmon Bo Balaylo. Okay, so Gemara also in Avodah Zorah. A home where there's no divrei Torah heard it in the evening in that house. Torah study is not at the night. Eishel Kloso, that house will be consumed by fire. Shenemar, kol choshech tome tomun l'sfunov, tochleu eish lo nofach, yera sorid bolo. Ain't sorel tamut chochem. Sorid means like the, the survivors. Shenemar ubesridim asher Hashem korek. So, let's see Rashi. Kol choshech tomen l'tzvunov kol laylo tzofun v'nechba mimatzpunei da Torah. The night, it's what? The Torah is it's, it's concealed from Torah. Here, kol choshech choshech is night time. Tomen l'tzvunov. Kol laylo tzofun v'nechba mimatzpunei da Torah. It's kept away from the secrets of Torah. Shein divrei Torah nishmo in bosa bayis. Divrei Torah not studied in that house. Tochlo eish lo nofach ze eisha shel gehenim. Shein tzorch nipuach. Normally you have to fan a fire that it should get larger. The fire of gehenim does not be fanned. Yera sor bolo mis shera beinov she sorid bolo. Why is there no Torah? It's like because it's 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 something that you you have a disdain for. Because you have disdain for it, that's the reason why there's no Torah. Mishra be'enov she sorid ba'olo. Why is it only at night time? It says, Reb Loza says that the house that does not have Torah at night time, that house will be consumed by fire. As it says, Tuchlo eish lo nofach yera sorid ba'olo ain't sorid tamot chochem. I mean, even the Pasuk was speaking about the Eish, we're talking about the Eish of Gehenim. But yet we're saying that house will be consumed by fire. Which fire? We're speaking about it seems to be a physical fire. Right? But we see when there's an absence of Torah, and we're saying the reason why Torah is not studied, because you don't value it. Other things have greater value. What's the Mida connect with Mida? Correct, correct, correct. So what does it mean? One said the Pshad is yeah. like this. It's known that the night, firstly, during the day, the person is, is preoccupied with other things. The Gemara says in Sanhedrin later, why not could create night? Because if a person would, would be day continuous, person would continuously be productive and work. He'd never study Torah. So at night time, he's, first, he's forced to slow down. So he should have time to study Torah. That's why Kodesh Baruch created night. Lo ivri laylo el lagirsa. Kodesh Baruch created night time to be girsa to study. So if Kodesh Baruch created the night time to study, so what are you using? What are you utilizing your time for? It was created specifically for that. During the day, there's no claim against you if you don't study. You have to earn a living. You have other things to do. You're preoccupied. But at night time, what are you busy with? As a result of that, therefore, there's a claim against the person. That's the simple understanding. Therefore, so evidently, what's the reason? Because you have a disdain for Torah. And therefore, because you have the stain for Torah, therefore, that's the consequence. That's the reaction. Torah is the most precious. How do you have a disdain for it? Therefore, Eshel Chloso, therefore, you'd be consumed by fire. I mean, you could say, you know, Torah itself is referred to fire. Coke, uh, right? Code of Orakesh Hashem. The words of Torah are like fire. Mm -hmm. So if you don't engage in the fire because you, you, have, you have a disdain for it, Hashem will bring other fire on your house. But simply, the way I learned a little bit deeper, Cited that the nighttime period is what is midas adin. It's midas adin. That's the reason why the nether forces 
Al Yitzi Odim Yechidi Balai, the person should not go out by himself at night time. The night time is a time for nether forces. The night time. That's the reason why if a person, even there's a question, even if you're up all night, comes morning, you still have to wash your hands. Right? Because there's a Ruach Tumah, there's a contaminated spirit on your hands, what we call Negel Vasa. That's why you have to wash. It's a time of the nether forces. Nether forces are something negative. That's the Midas Adin. Now, what is Torah said? Nighttime is din, that if there's any degree of infraction, a person is actually could be hurt and could be harmed because of that. What is Torah? The Gemara says in Avodah Zorah, Torah is, what is also din. Torah is what is emes. Emes is din. That's what din is. So at a time when there's din, you have to engage in din. So, and that's why you're protected. But if you don't engage in the, in the fire, which is Torah, which is din, then you'll be subject to din, which is what? that creates the Shmir. It counters, it counters the, it's the counter force to counter that negative, the negative effect. Okay, this is what they teach them in Russia. Okay. They teach them what not to learn. It's Alpi Kabbalah. It's Alpi Kabbalah. The Torah Shvichsav. It's not only it's not only uh, Targum. Even the Chumash. Chumash. Regular Chumash. You shouldn't study at night. It's for Alpi Kabbalah. It's not. It has no relevance. It's less. If the Chazos. Gemara Torah Baalpeh. Torah Baalpeh. Question of Torah Shabbat Torah Peh. Better to learn. It's cited on Pikabola. It's better to learn Torah Shabbat Peh at night. Gemara, Gemara, Moshe, Gemara. Leave some. It's not Chumash, not Tanach. You learn the writings of uh, of Rav Nachman of Breslov at night, right? No, no, no. But I also uh, read the Chumash around four in the morning. It's okay. After Chatzos is okay. You say Slichos uh, after midnight. It's already Midas Arachman. Okay.